In this video, I'm going to show you how I do an acylic acid treatment with my Laura B's acylic acid vaporizer. I remove uh, the entrance reducers from the two larger hives. I remove uh, all the plugs that I have placed in the uh, uh, gas ports near the entrances. I then uh, plug the entrance just before I uh, start the gassing process. Sometimes, if there are too many bees, I use my smoker to clear them out a little bit. I insert my uh, charged vaporizer and flip it. I give it a few taps to make sure that the um, crystals or powder or whatever uh, leaves the cup and enters the heating chamber. When the acylic acid uh, crystals hit the heating element, the temperature is going to drop. When that temperature gets back up to 400 Fahrenheit, I remove a vaporizer and add a new cup. Again, it's a little easier if you can clear some of the bees away to put that uh, entrance uh, plug in. Here we are, insert it upside down, flip it over, tappy tap tap, temperature drops, and we just wait for it to get back up to 400. Remove the vaporizer, add a new cup, and we're going to move to uh, the last hive here. A little smoke.
need to clear a few of the bees out. Insert it upside down. I always hold the cup when it's upside down. Flip it over. Tappy tap tap. And wait for the temp to go back up. I removed the vaporizer and set a timer. We're gonna give these guys about 10-15 minutes to uh, spread the uh, fumes from the um, vapors throughout the hive. While I'm waiting, I uh, add one of the cups with a little bit of water in in it to the vaporizer and uh, uh, process it through the element and it pretty much cleans out the, uh, the vaporizer. After about 10 minutes, I remove all the uh, plugs I put in the entrances. This plug's a little stuck. I'm gonna get my uh, hive tool and see if we can pry it out of there. be the chance to get back inside. I give them a little smoke to help clear the uh, entrances so I can uh, put the reducers back in place. Smoke is going out. Well, that's pretty much it. So uh, be sure to visit uh, myslovenianhive.com. Uh, and uh, thanks for watching.